Outrage is growing over a Russian boy who was adopted by an American mom only to be put on a plane by himself and returned to Russia. The mother claimed he was violent and that she was misled by the orphanage. But now all Russian adoptions to the United States could be suspended. Joining me now is Elisa White Kowski, and she and her two children, both adopted from Russia, and she's written a book, a guide to Russian adoption. It's good to see you today, Elisa. Hello. And why don't you introduce me to your two boys? Sure. This is Charlie right here, and this is Jack right here. Nice to see you They're guys. Seven and eight years old from St. Petersburg, Russia. All right. Given how well you know this process inside and out, how do you analyze the situation with this Russian mom? I mean, with the American mom and the Russian child? Right. Um, well, I, I do just feel real sad that she adopted him um, and has had him home for only six months. Uh, as far as we know, hadn't hadn't really reached out to anybody as far as any of the resources that we have here in the states to get some help with some of the obviously very difficult issues she was facing, um, and then just returned him to Russia. Um, it's it's really kind of unbelievable because when you file when you part of the adoption process is an I six hundred A form, and that's an yeah. orphan petition and that that's telling that's the United States government telling you that yes you can adopt this child uh, and then your visa and your visa um, interview in Moscow will that is then telling you that okay yes you can take right. this child to the United so, States this child was an American citizen once he landed on US soil whatever the point of entry so was. So that being said what would you say now to all these parents I think Russia is something like third in the number of international adoptions here okay what do you say to all those parents now who are waiting for children in Russia and that's in jeopardy right I say keep the faith adoption international adoption is a leap of faith uh, I feel confident that the Russians and the Americans are going to work this out um, the Russians I believe have invited American officials to Moscow to sign some sort of agreement a bilateral agreement where um, it would just prove to have better safeguards in place for people to ensure the health and safety and everything of children that are adopted from Russia all right and I uh, I see right there it's a perfect advertisement for why it's great to have um, children from other countries back in your home. Guys, thank you for coming on TV with me today. Say thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Elisa, good to see you. Good luck. Thank you.